hi everyone um, I'm up on here to do a tutorial on um, how to add wallpaper to your um, KP by hand or LG cookie um, I didn't receive the um, CD-ROM like I bought my phone off for of, um, eBay so um, the seller didn't provide the CD-ROM nor the manual but he had um, told me that you can like download the manual and the CD-ROM off of the internet and that's what I did so I'm gonna show you guys how to do that alright so okay so since um since I didn't have the um the CD the D, the ROM excuse me since I didn't have the ROM I have to download it but I'm gonna show you guys um here's my um default wallpaper here excuse me you know, I just got it like two days ago Hello. okay so here's the default wallpaper which is the flower and I'm going to show you guys how to add your own wallpaper well not it own because I make my own wallpaper with um, Adobe Flash Player oh, no, excuse me not Adobe Flash Player <laughs> Adobe Photoshop and um it's really easy you know it doesn't matter what program you use you know you can always make your own wallpaper or you can download it off the internet but nothing is more fun than making your own wallpaper um, I'm very artsy so <laughs> I like to do my own stuff all the time so um so I'm gonna show you guys alright so first you need to download it so let me show you guys how to go, to go get it downloaded you can like go to google and you just you can just type in um KP 500, um, like KP 500, um, download software, right? And, um, you can go to this website here, which is, um, the LG cell phone blog. And that's lg-phones.org. I will put a um, link to that in my um, description. So, like, yeah, you can go here. Um, and then you can go, if you come to this screen, like, then you can go down and it says here, um, LG Cookie KP500 PCs to download. You can click on that there. And then it says here, click here to download a PC suit. Alright, you're going to click it, right? It's gonna um, come to your computer in a zip file. Make sure you know where to save it or whatever. Um, I use WinWire to unzip my files, which is that right there. WinWire is a program. I I'm pretty sure you can download it. Um, I don't know if this computer came with that, but I'm pretty sure um, you can download it. So um, it unzips your files. Once you unzip your file, um, let me show you. I don't know if I have the files. I think I delete them all. But, um, let me just show you real fast. Okay, so, once you come to this, like, once you unzip your file, you'll see, like, um, a, 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 like, one of these images, like that. One of those images here. And then you'll see, like, PC suit. Once you open that, you're gonna see, like, um, other program files, like, you'll see like all the stuff you need the drivers <clears throat> is in like one um folder and everything else is in their in their own folder so like download all the um drivers any program under that pc suit i mean under that zip file like you have to download it like anything that says dot exe um like download those okay and once you download it um you'll get this excuse me I once you download it you'll get this right here you get um, a wizard a connection wizard that's gonna establish the connection between you and your phone and your um and your um computer excuse me <laughs> all right so if your um phone because you're supposed to do this before you have the USB plugged um the USB connection um, 
in order to get like the content so you can like put images and stuff I use the PC suit some people use mass storage like sometimes if you connect the phone to the computer um, sometimes you connect the phone to the computer the um, by mass storage like um, the computer will make like folders or whatnot but sometimes it doesn't work like I tried that way and it didn't work for me so this is why I'm doing it this way okay alright so um so since my thing is already on PC suit I don't really have to do anything um maybe next time like um if you don't want to like um co go here to go here like you can just like um put always acts and so when you just um enter your USB to your phone it just automatically acts what you want to do in the beginning but anyways since it's already on PC suit, it's going to establish this connection wizard. It's going to establish connection between the phone and the um, computer. So I'm going to push next here. Oh, excuse me. All right. Well, I'll push next. And this is going to give you options like Bluetooth or USB. Since it's USB, it's going to find out. So here's um, the model, model KP500. Finish, right? And then this comes up. It's letting me know that my phone's connected and you can um, be able to do anything here. Usually if you push mass um, storage, like, this item here won't be able to be touched. None of these but the music one. But since it's on PC suit, everything's able to get um, pushed. So I'm going to go ahead and push contents. And this, another screen should come up on its own. <laughs> All right. Since I disconnect, I have to disconnect it again. So give me one second, you guys. Alright. So disconnected. And then reconnected. Connection. Alright. Well, so that right there is letting me know that. Uh, that right there. Okay. So once you, like, connected and disconnected, um... It's going to establish the connection again. Connection wizard. Push next. See, it's actually USB or Bluetooth. I uh, got the USB connected. It's going to establish the connection. Push finish. Then everything, this screen comes up. Push contents. Now this should be happening to your phone right now, like, it's then you know that the contents um, connection is like working as connected to your phone. Okay, so since I made my own, um, I use Adobe um, Photoshop since I made my own and located it, located it. So like, I'm gonna go to where it's located. Alright, and I'm just gonna like, um, choose one of these files. And I'm gonna push this arrow here. And, and first I need to pick um, what I want. Pictures. And then I choose this. It's a JPEG. Then I um, go to this side. And it's going to transfer over to my phone. And once it's here, that means it's on your phone already. And it's so simple. So let's see it. Push cancel. Since I'm like going to be off it. Push cancel. Go to um, <clears throat> my stuff here under entertainment my stuff my images and here we go my file is right there that's the one I made and then look use as wallpaper set I'm not sure what the rest of these things here are for widget or that but all that's what I choose changed So, when I get to the main screen, there you go. It's the um, picture that I um, that I made and uploaded. So, there you go. You guys. If you guys have any questions, go ahead and, and um, ask it, and I'll be happy to help you guys. Um. I believe that's it. Um, just leave a question, whatever.